What's your relationship with Marshall? Oh, no. What's your relationship with Marshall since Shady contract ended? Riff, what's your relationship with Marshall? What's your relationship with Marshall? Him. I ain't never, I ain't never met him. I, I've, I've seen him in concert a few times. But people, I, I'm not, you wouldn't even know because I, I, I put on a hoodie and I just went and just watched the show. I went to two. Yeah. But yeah, I never met him in person. Marshall's the homie. Like, for the six years that I was with, with Marshall, he showed nothing but respect. And my hat's off for Marshall because it takes a lot of balls to a lot of art, allow an artist like me to do a record like Love Story under Shady. So my hat's always off to Shady and Marshall for allowing me to spread my wings and do something creatively that otherwise some other labels might have been scared to do. So I got nothing but love for Shady Records always. Y'all, do you have got any like unreleased? something ever in the vault that just 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 somehow won't see the light of day or will or just potentially or something like that i wish we did everything that marshall and i recorded actually came out and um it was a very those sessions were very private i don't have a single photo of us working in the studio um for the six years i was there it was a very private and, and so the memories are are really just my own you know so uh it's just something that I can just pass down as a story to my kids and and to people who are interested in hearing about it. But I don't really have any documented photographs or footage of those sessions. It's just sessions that happened and stories that I got that I had to tell. Yeah. Did y'all 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 have like late late nights in the studio? Or is it something that's like not yeah. disclosed that you just don't feel comfortable like talk about a, a vibe or like what y'all get you know what I mean like uh yeah some of the vibes were super super good but because I'm so stubborn you'd imagine me coming into the studio having ideas and maybe at some point even disagreeing with some of the creative direction and it's a really hard thing to do when you're like looking at Marshall like man I don't know about this he's like yo trust me and I'm like I don't know about that but you know getting through those those creative homes allowed us to build something that was special, but it, it took a lot of heart to to say no to things that I didn't agree with, and it also took a lot of heart for me to uh, bend and do things that otherwise I wouldn't have been uh, apt to do because I trusted his creative vision, you know. So do you think that maybe something that you did or said something like y'all have a, a song that could have happened that you said nah I don't really want to do it and then later you were like man I'm a because I did that with Diplo a lot like there's so many tracks that he was like send me the beat and I'm like I, I don't even got nothing to say to this and then you know what I'm saying and so I definitely like fucked myself over in of like probably ten situations yeah you know the first song that I did with Diplo was um uh Animal. And I did Animal in Vegas at Molly Ma's house with Pooh Bear. And Fifi Dobson ended up singing the hook on uh, on that record. That was the only record that I had created with Diplo. And after we made that record, we went on to make more records, more records with, with Pooh Bear. And there was one record that I really, really didn't believe in, but the rest of the crew believed in it. And so I put... I put it on blast that uh, I was like, yo, Marshall, if you want me to do this, man, you you got to give me a drop. You got to, like, intro this song. And so if you hear Good Girl, at the beginning of Good Girl, Marshall gives me a drop and an excuse to do Girl because I didn't really uh, believe in the song. But um, I did it, and I compromised um, creatively to do the song. And, um, hey... You know that that those are steps that you need to take when you're stepping into a new situation. So, is that a song you got like in the ammunition, just in the back chamber? That's. Like <laughs>